You know, some things are a bit too important to muck around. And Daniel appreciated that? Uh, her appreciate might be a bit strong. <laughs> this is just the way I want things to be. Me too. That was our first fight, and I would really like it to be our last. Mm, me too. Can we still do the kiss and make up part? See, overall, Daniel's a good kid. I mean, he's a bit misguided in a few ways, but he's got a good head and a good heart. So you're not too worried about it? No, oh, he'll do all right. Especially now that he's with Amber, anyway. Yeah, you like her? Yeah, I'm surprised, too. But I think she's actually good for him. I know you've got stuff that you've been working towards, so if you want to go to uni, that's cool, too. I just need to do what's right for me. Yeah, for sure. And you'll be great at it. And I'm going to be right there beside you. See, Amber grounds him. Because he can be a bit flighty, and knowing that she's there to rein him in is a bit of a relief. OK, so you are still a bit worried about it. Well, yeah, Daniel's the only family I've got right now. I don't want to lose him. You know what I really want to do? What? Take a gap year. For real? I can go to uni whenever I want. What's one year? What's five years? Daniel loves you. You can only control your own behaviour. You can't steer his course any more than he can steer yours. Then it's a good thing that I've got Amber as my keep Daniel in line insurance policy, isn't it? Hmm? <laughs> Why do you smile, man? Ah, he just thought that cop father of hers would have paid dividends one day. <laughs> you really want to do this? Yes! We could go travelling together. That is exactly what I want. I want to travel, I want romance, I want spontaneity. We're going to see the world! Woo! <laughs> <laughs>